rabbit all morning, so let's hover over, over to the driving range and hit a few. I just found something that I have to show you. I thought that was super crazy. They took a picture of their their kitchen and then they implement the different styles that they want and the AI system automatically generates uh, a new design. Ever since ChatGPT a few months ago, AI has been reaching newer and newer heights. I was um, online watching home content and this came up and I thought about it and I was like, well, I definitely need to share it with you guys. So today I'm gonna be reviewing remodeled AI. Before we get started with the video, make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Obviously this is the before and after, so it's just a standard house, and then look at that. These are just some of the presets, but does that really tell the whole story? I think the best way to test out this software is to go through different types of rooms. One, let's go with a basic room. Two, let's go with a, eh, a dirty room. And then three, let's go with like a slaughterhouse, you know, j j just for the test of it. Okay. so. This is the gothic one. Honestly, the, what do you guys think? That's honestly pretty cool. So it transformed this regular living room. This, this reg <laughs> I'm stupid. It transformed this regular room into a gothic style. And I, what do you guys think about this one? All right, let's go with the second option. So this is a bit of a harder test AI you got me once style is going to be hmm, Tim Burton is a style that's Mediterranean mmm I don't know how I feel about it what do you what do you guys think about this one I mean this one was pretty cool it wasn't too bad but I think we're getting a little carried away here let's see the last and final style how good is this AI system this one let's go from this to a what? workshop fitness gym boom as you guys can tell i'm into fitness it's i don't think that looks like a gym at all does that look like a gym I think it takes like the modern style. So it takes the combination of multiple, which is pretty cool, which honestly I should have known, but it got me on this one. Let's go ahead and go to a different website to see how good it compares to another website. So we're here with AI room planner. You see on the left side over here, it's not, it's not bad or nothing. I mean, I saw the potential, but did the AI really do what it was supposed to do? I don't think the AI worked as hard. What the AI did there was it basically got a new bed, took away the counter on the left, took away the clothes. It didn't like the clutter. It got like a little uh, cabinet and added a desk. It looks like a way better desk and it added some wall stuff and it got rid of that big puff, that big cotton ball in the ceiling. So I wouldn't recommend AI room planner, to be honest. Seems kind of bad. We're back in roomable. As you can see here, it got rid of the closet space and it, it just converted it because it's AI into a building. It went from a house to a condo because it's AI. One added a door and it added a few different little things. I like that each one of these changes the root, changes the wood, and that's pretty cool. So let's go back over here and let's just switch images and now let's go with the bohemian style and this is going to be a media room uh, empty room no create design so how good is this ai so far it's my favorite ai system to help you come up with better ideas so um if your interior designer isn't better than the last two i think you should fire them it went from this room all the way to this room this second room is my favorite room that ha has been designed by ai so far cool. i like the chair there not bad this one is amazing so roomable ai is really good can it knock out 
all three designs in a row. It's got two. Third time is the charm. And let's just see how it does with the last image. The French country. And this is going to be a bathroom. So it took this prison cell. And it transformed it into this awesome, this great, this beautiful, amazing bathroom. Look at that. And it has a little uh, powder, powder room. Is that what it's called? Powder room. Ooh, this one is really cool too. It turned that room into a bathtub and then another bathtub. I think the last one is my favorite one, but that's pretty much it for today's video regarding AI. Is AI going to dominate everything you do in life? Will we have any jobs? Are we gonna end up like the people in Wally? I have it all morning, so let's uh -huh. hover over to the driving range and hit a few virtual balls in space. Nah, we did that yesterday. I don't wanna do that. Well, then what do you wanna do? I don't know. Something. I don't know, but what I do know is that I appreciate you for sticking through the entirety of this video. So should you fire your interior designer in place of AI? I'm gonna leave that decision up to you. But once again, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see y'all in the next one.